guys, Matt Lipke here with your Gamer Goggles, Gamer-Goggles.com and today we're going to go and take a look at something really cool. This is a Starfinder. Ouch! Starfinder! Kind of like, somebody needs to do a Starfinder spoof on Star Trek and Across the Universe. Uh, that is out of my wheelhouse. Oh, come on. Ben Looms, it's right up your alley. He's probably going to be mad at me because I just said his name wrong. He doesn't watch these anyway. He should. He's my fan. Alright, anyway. So, inside the core rule book pawn collection for Pathfinder. Starfinder. I'm probably going to do that a lot. Just bear with me. You get all of these things. All of them. With those little numbers there pretty rad. Anyway, so we're going to go through it. I'm going to set the cool little paper cardboardy thing aside uh, and then we're going to zoom in some more and we're going to go over all these. We have a Android Abolitionist, Android Ace, Android Battle Mage. That's interesting. Uh, Android Crusader Chaplain, Android Corporate Techno Mage, Bodyguard, Envoy, Far Seeker, Operative, Technomancer, <laughs> we have uh, Standard Bearers, Saboteurs, we have a Tech Immortal, we have, here, let me turn this this way, a BMC Mauler, and Blackwind Sepulchers. Then we have the Contemplative. We have Death's Head. Well, I'll turn that that way for you. Necro Glider. It kind of looks like a skateboard. Dwarven Soldier. We have a Combat Drone here. Oh, we already saw those. Another Soldier. An Elf Operative. Huh. Surprisingly, they look Elven to me. They haven't changed much in 25,000 years. The Oxian Necrotives, or Necrovites. And we have a Half-Elf Operative, and I really like that cape, cloak, whatever you want to call it. We have a Human Adventurer, Half-Orc Soldier, Half-Elf Steward, Human Adventurer, Human Enhanced Commando, Human Envoy, and an Immortal. Human Envoy, Gunfighter, a Knight of Galarian with a Saw Sword, I like it. Human Pilot, Soldier, a Solarian, they're fun. A Human Priest, Soldier, Space Pirate, a lot of humans here. Another Soldier who looks a little bit beefier in armor. Uh, human Starfinder 1. Human Trailblazer, Human Tabori Miner, another Steward, Starfinder 2, another Trailblazer, an Iteron Voidrunner, another Immortal, we have Kasatha Close Combatant, an Empath, Hell Knight. Oh, they look bad to the bone. Great job with the art, guys. An Explorer. Envoys. Negotiators. Outlaws. Solarians. Adventure. Thaumaturges. A Technomancer. Those are cool looking Technomancers. Kind of look like blood mages, but those are cool technomancers. And we have Lashunta, Lashunta icons. We have a Han, it probably goes this way. We have 
Mystics. Operatives. These are Lushunta again. Uh, an engineer. Lushunta Solarian. Snipers. Priest. Starship engineer. Technomancer. A thief. Xeno Wardens. Orocorns, two of them. Uh, dropships. Ori Bridgers. Ringworks Wanderer. Hyvonix Titan Hauler. That looks big. For some reason, it's designed to go in the thing that way, but I guarantee you it flies that way. We have robot security. Sheeran a bad R Corp. A bad R Corp. That sounds sounds kind of fun. I'm probably saying that wrong. Sheeran mechanic. Hackers. Technicians. Mystics. They look like they should be mystics. Scholars. Yeah, I, I can see that too. Uh, Solarian. And we have the UE Hive Guard in the Star Hive Drone MK3s or Mark 3s. And then we have. I right, showed you that. We have Vesk Ambassadors and we have another Titan Hauler. We have Vesk Champions here. Free Captains. A lot of Vesk on this one. Investigators. We have the Vesk Paragons. Mercenaries. Mechanics. Scientists. <laughs> kind of throwback to uh, some cooler times that we, the way we envisioned our aliens, right? Uh, Vesk Soldiers. Vesk Xenodroids. And a whole bunch of little, get, little guys here. We've got uh, Augmented... Oops. Augmented as Ahsokis or Yaskis, my bad. Uh, drone hover, hover drone, duh. I know how to read. Stealth drones, uh, no mystics. And goblins, you can't go wrong with space goblins. You just can't. Uh, gray halfling pilots, Yasoki bounty hunter, sharpshooter, scoundrel, mechanic. Yusuke with a jetpack, uh, the sniper again, Solarian, the star shaman, that, he looks cool, that's actually a really cool picture too. Uh, Technomancer, the art in here is actually really doing a good job. And then we get into some ships. So we have the Iteran Ven Vencerai, or wait, Vencerai, Rai, looks like Chai. Uh, Thumbtech Omen Bringer, it looks like it's bringing some omens. Uh, Vindicus re Retirement. Vindicus Retirement. I am here to retire you. Uh, Vindicus Tyrant. Um, there's three of those. And then, oh, well, this one's not a ship. Uh, so, um, this Sar Sarsian or Sark Essian. Depending on, you know, what language they're basing it off of. Or they're making it up themselves, even. Here's the Iteran Millennia. What is that thing? It's like a cross between Cthulhu and a Stegosaurus. Sark. And we have a Vindicus Tyrant again. Another Omen Bringer. We have another one of those guys. And we have another Titan Hauler. So those all repeat. So inside the Starfinder Pawns kit, well, you get. A wide variety, more than you need to play your first couple of games of Starfinder, uh, until you wait or you know finished waiting for the Starfinder miniatures from Ninja Division or Soda Pop or whichever company they're using. I think it's Ninja Division. I'm almost positive it's Ninja Division. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. This has been a box breaking with Matt Lemke from Three Gamer Goggles, GamerDashGoggles.com.